Go Green has a new meeting in Meridian Township. Aside from being a community that is part of Michigan State University's Spartan Country, Meridian is using new sustainable technology in an ongoing effort to protect the environment, reduce carbon emissions, and reduce energy consumption. Changes are quickly evolving in lighting in our homes and workplaces. Soon consumers will no longer be able to purchase incandescent light bulbs for their home. What is this energy savings revolution all about? How does this lighting work while using less electricity? Light-emitting diodes are solid-state lighting components. They have no moving parts or fragile parts and can last for decades. LEDs are not only ready for general illuminating applications, presenting a new enhancing option to save energy and maintenance costs, as well as eliminate the hazardous waste issues associated with mercury-containing light bulbs and tubes. What are some of the other advantages of LED technology? If properly installed, they can reduce light pollution in the night sky. They reduce energy consumption more than any other form of lighting. They are made of non-toxic materials and can be recycled. They have a smaller bulb, don't use breakable filaments, and don't attract insects. They produce light in the visible spectrum. What does that mean? No ultraviolet rays and no infrared emissions. We buy, as consumers, all these LED products all day long. We probably just don't really realize uh, how much LEDs have kind of uh, come into our life in one form or another. But when we talk about the commercial lighting side, this takes on a whole new level because now I can really project that light in a very efficient way. This is something that we could never do uh, in the past. If I think about a street light uh, setting, that light, specifically in a pole, sometimes is just being projected all over in a full sphere. Well now with, let's say, LED specifically, we can control that light to make sure that, first of all, it's below that 90 degree plane, so it's not going out into the atmosphere. And separately, we can actually make sure we're controlling that light to deliver that light in a specific pattern. If you go to any of these cities at night and you really can't see stars, a lot of this is because now we have all these lights that are glowing and we have a lot of this light uh, going out into the sky. You want to avoid that. Stem from the Energy and Conservation Block Grant for the Michigan Department of Energy, Labor and Economic Growth, the grants awarded aim to create and retain jobs and conserve energy while reducing greenhouse gas emissions. $17.5 million in grants were awarded to 125 communities across Michigan. Meridian Township received $50,000 in grant monies for the placement of LED streetlights in downtown Okemos. Large communities, and Meridian is one of those, received a direct grant from the federal government. But in addition, a small amount of our money for uh, high uh, advanced lighting, like LED lighting, was made available to both large cities and smaller cities. This lighting project brings about other benefits for the community as well. Meridian Township is committed to revitalizing older commercial areas of the community, such as downtown Okemos. Termed as place making, it strives to make this area a more walkable community through the improved lighting, improving township aesthetics, increasing local tourism, and encouraging economic development. With, you know, the downturn of the economy and things like that, I think people are now looking inward and looking at the local economy and looking at local businesses. And, and people are paying attention of where they're shopping and spending their local dollars. And by helping, supporting the local businesses, hopefully will help them to inject additional capital, which creates jobs and pays taxes, and will help revitalize and hopefully improve uh, an area that's really stayed stagnant for a long, long time. What I'm hoping for is that by improving the appearance of the downtown area, that the vacant buildings that we have right now other prospective businesses will find this to be a more desirable to conduct their business to. Making stronger communities is a component to help make an economically stronger Michigan. Sustainable communities are important for a number of reasons. First of all, costs are going up in every area. Energy is one area that we can control by using more efficient um, appliances and equipment and by being conscious of how to conserve energy. Uh, it's also important from an economic point of view for Michigan jobs. Our state has the capability to manufacture many of these new technologies and then to distribute them throughout the U.S. and abroad. As energy becomes more and more expensive, it's important for communities to figure out how to reduce those costs so that they can continue to function.
In Okemos, the Meridian Township Board is committed to saving energy and reducing carbon emissions to help protect the environment. They are now one step closer to reaching its goals of sustainability through the energy savings from these LED lights. Hopefully that will inspire individuals of saying that the DDA specifically is making this investment. This may be a place where I want to invest my private dollars and, and help improving that area and really create a, a greater sense of community.